Hi, my name is Taylor Robertson. I'm a robotics software developer in Waterloo. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to create a multi-pass weld. To start, I'm going to define my start position, and then I'm going to program a simple linear weld. This will function as my root pass, and a tutorial on this can be found under how to program a linear weld. Once I have programmed my root pass, I'm going to click done and weld my part. Once my root pass has been welded, I'm going to go back into edit mode. And from our selection of choices, I'm going to select add pass. It is going to give me a selection for my root weld. In this case, I'm going to select the weld that I just created and I have the option to click go to weld start on any of the available root passes to determine which root pass I would like to use. Once I have determined the root pass I would like to use, I can hit confirm and then I can move forward to teach my pass. To teach my pass, I can decide what direction I would like this pass to be taught in by moving the robot to the side of the weld I would like to start my pass on. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and teach my pass in the same direction. So it is instructing me to move the robot to my pass start. I'm going to unlock the robot and move it into the new seam off of the root pass. Teach my weld start and move over to do a long press to teach my weld end. Can move that up out of the way again. And now my pass two has been completed. At this point, I'm going to go ahead, click done and weld my next pass so that I have it in place to teach any additional passes.